La uh, new content percent. This regular one or something freaky. So we're just um, this is speed run to unlock and build the new base stuff. I feel like it's one of those games where I wouldn't be surprised if it was still like 30 quid or something. Hey Kinjo, your thoughts on the update? It pretty much kills uh, glitched speedruns, but the performance updates are really really good, as are the, uh, the quality of life changes that they've been brought over from below zero. There's a few, uh, like, changes for normal people, for the non-speedrunning folk, that are a bit, like, uh, not super great, like, like that. Open locker then immediately leave, next time we have no matter where I am, I can access that locker, go storage, that is a bug that's, well, a glitch that's still in the game. Um... So opening the PDA, you get like half a second of uh, camera lock, where, well, not quite lock, but it's like sort of juddery. You can't use the scroll wheel in inventories anymore, which probably most people didn't, but if you did know about it, it, it changed your life, and now you can no longer do it. Uh, nine... Um, you know, this, I'm breaking rocks a little bit faster than no more less because you bind the scroll wheel to any action keys, and each scroll counts as multiple inputs of the action. Pretty fantastic to run this game for someone to click four times with this rush out the atmosphere side, but I can just scroll once. Due to running at least 30 FPS and you want to scroll slowly, not quickly, you're scrolling quickly actually makes it worse. Also trying to do some sort of helix eye motion to gather resources in this smooth fashion. Can be a little bit awkward though, depending on the resource distribution. In addition, you drown at minus eight, not zero, and swimming top of the water is 33% faster. Until I get a seat light and then I will be doing it again. You can run with the flashlight now. Poggers. No dogs here, but whatever. We can find them elsewhere. It's not the end of the world. So I have to, I can't use the scroll wheel here. I have to manually click each item I want to switch over, which, as I said, is annoying. But I'll just do this. Not my scanner, though. Yeah, so you'll see that sort of weird, juddery camera every time I close the PDA. That's what I'm talking about. So I need two boxes to start a run. Well, it's more likely they spawn here. You're not guaranteed that they do. Not guaranteed one, never mind the two you actually need. Oh, I did get two, so it's all good. Has it used refurbished for 189? Yeah, I guess that's, yeah. I guess that's fair, I suppose. Some old games get really valuable. Manually click everything. Uh, hold the sprinty key can be menu opening as I make myself a knife, an O2 tank, and a sea glide. But I've already got an O2 tank, and I actually want to make myself a PS2 play games play on the PS4. I don't actually know. Also, going to make myself some fins because they work together in Below Zero, so we'll try them out here as well. So this, the knife which the game will want to show off, so I have to close the menu and then open it again. There you go. Manually click everything in here. And go storage again. Table Coral, which splits into one again. They changed it back. Hooray. And now I'm going to go get some. And also the map is on a different button to the light toggle, which is fantastic. Grab some sandstone so I can make the habitat builder. Because I do indeed need to build the rooms. And up. PS2 version is $100 cheaper. Fair, fair. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I've never had uh, PlayStations. And back. Make myself the habitat builder. Five hundred and sixty-three euros for an unopened version. Wow, incredible! PS4 doesn't play any old PS4 PS games. I thought it played PS3. Does it not? Yeah, weird. Oh yeah, it wanted to show me the builder tool. Thanks, game. It was very cool. 
Gonna make myself a base with a hench. And a solar panel. And the locker. So I need six glass. Uh, and for finding, uh, I don't need to make an upgraded O2 tank, but I guess it's probably a good idea. But that does cost me two glass, so. <laughs> I need a bit more metal for it as well. There's this one sticking out of the ground. Oh, not quite. Oh, yes, because the, uh, the way terrain loads will be the below zero way as well. I won't have the silver to upgrade my O2 tank. That's fine. This is all fine. Okay. Gonna go flare storage. Flare. Use a flare. Try and open the locker. You cannot. Next time you open your PDA, no matter where you are, you can access that locker. So we're gonna go unlock the habitat, uh, the new base pieces now. How finish game? Not gonna finish game. So we're just doing the new contents. This is just like I did with uh, what the dock update. For this update, I'm just making the new base pieces. And on through, looking for metal salvage and teeth, I guess. Teeth are relevant. I do indeed need six of them. Nope. Okay. Nope. Okay. Have I gone too far? No, I haven't gone too far. Okay, good. It's over here. Grab some air, a bit further on, and down. Ooh, another metal salvage. Hooray! Maybe get a quartz on the way down, too. Nice. And then maybe we can get some lithium while we're there. That would also be good. Because I do need seven lithium. Oh heck, that's a wall planter. That's unfortunate, that wasted some time. Yeah, because unfortunately the scan progress resets on stuff like this, which is real annoying. Nah. That's fine. I get to keep the metal salvage at least. Lithium is not your friend today. This is very true. Cool. So that's that's unlocked the uh, the new base pieces that we're going to make later. But I do still need to get more items for them. So we're doing this. Make some metal. Dump this. And flare storage again. So once again, use a flare trying to open the locker. You cannot. Next time you from your PDA, no matter where you are, you can access the access that locker. So I can dump all the lithium. Hopefully, Abby's home. I'm off. Enjoy the woods. Where did you get that shit? Uh, it's from a creator called Umwelt. Uh, they are American-based. America-based. So the postage was quite a bit. But I love this shirt. It's great. You, I'm, I'm keeping an eye out for any dogs picking up metal. Because as we said, we do indeed need six teeth. So... Two teeth, that's a pretty good start. As I go over here to get my lithium, my seven lithium game, okay? Seven. Not not five. And don't don't take a lithium every time I respawn either. That was very rude. Very rude. Further study recommended. Not sure how much the fins are uh, making a difference here, but
Here the air bladder's pretty good now. Yeah, I get a little boost of air, but um, I don't need to craft it, so I'm not gonna. Like I'm, I'm never gonna go up is a thing. I, if I was gonna go up, like if it was, this was hardcore or something like that, then maybe. But because I don't need to go up, I'm just gonna go down and drown. Then I'm I'm not that bothered. Because we're just heading to the mountain island to get our lithium, then we'll drown and go back. And keep our two teeth, hopefully. Detecting massive energy signature in the region. It's not going to be day for another four minutes, which is a little annoying because it's harder to find the lithium when it's night time. But hey ho. Maybe that means I should get lithium first. If this. This ends up failing. I'll get lithium for it. Won't fail. It'll be fine. So passing one hundred meters. One. Two. Nope. Three. Nope. Thirty seconds. Four. Oh, my lithium, he stole it. Five. There it is. Yeah, warpers can teleport items. It's it's not very common. I assume this update is cosmetic, quality of life and bugs fixes only. It is not! There are some new base pieces. And that is what we're currently speedrunning to make. The new base pieces. So I think I got six. I need uh, just just one more lithium. Why not backpatch the interactive item glow? Yeah, I'm surprised they didn't, to be honest. I'm surprised the item glow didn't get put in this patch. I just need... Uh, one more lithium, but I take two. There's one. I'll just get a second, just in case. There you go. Just in case, I need to pay the uh, the lithium toll. There you go. Cool. That's all the items I can't get near my base. Now I'm gonna make make the ingots and stuff, and we'll all be set. And then I just sit next to some dogs and wait. Are you sure it's not a different menu other than accessibility? No, we checked all the menus. You do spawn in the floor, which is very strange. I, I don't really know why. So manually click everything to pick it all up, because of course you do. Do 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 do. That's four, and this is six. Six quarts. Where's my flare? Where actually is the flare? I want to pick it up so it's not as bright in here. But I, there it is. It's in the sky. Okay. This. And the plasteel. Well, that plasteel's making. I need. Uh, I've got five. So I'm going to need a bit more metal. Actually, a fair bit more metal because I need. Um, I need a hatch and stuff. So we'll grab like. After the dogs have uh, dropped teeth, I can. I can grab metal off them, I guess. Yeah, I need the. Oh, you're right. I will need. I'll need two quartz. You're right. I, I guess just one, but deconstructing is slower, so I'll grab two. Tooth, though. I guess maybe the air bladder would have been nice here, I suppose. Or having to keep going down to, to watch the dogs, maybe, but... I don't know. Oh, that's an interesting bug. The, uh... 
The dogs aren't very good at picking up metal anymore. <laughs> yeah, they're not... They're not great at picking up metal anymore. <laughs> okay. Teeth do seem to drop a little bit faster, but that might I might just be being lucky. Yeah, they've uh I'm pretty sure they always used to pick it up with their mouths, but maybe I just didn't pay much attention. Um I don't know. Hey, final tooth. Oxygen. More aggressive, same with the head crabs on the Aurora, lots more. Have the head crabs on the Aurora as well. Oh, really? Huh. Back to base. To do our crafting. To finish the run. Welcome aboard, Captain. I don't have a... Oh, maybe I should have kept one of those gold to make another um, another thing, maybe. I don't know. Uh, so while... We'll set up the... This... Uh, what? Oh, yeah, okay. Sure. Stop it! We're trying to be speedy here. Speedy mouse? Maybe. Exit animation still give you oxygen. Okay, that's good at least. That's five and six. Oh, how much? How much do I need for this? One to seven. Now I need to make a. Oh, I need more metal for the multi-purpose room. I forgot about you. Part day, Kirby. Part day. Forgot about the multi-purpose room. Two copper, disgraceful. Scanning this will get me two metal. There you go. Sure is party in here. Is it is there someone in the chat with a birthday? Imagine needing titanium and getting only copper. I know. It's a travesty. So we want this, we want this. Birthdays in 13 days. Ooh. Excite. Excite bike. Wait. What am I missing? More titanium. I need more titanium. My goodness. I need like one and a salvage. I miscalculated how much metal I'd need by a fair amount. I forgot that these roofs need metal. Oh! Cast roofs part of the update? Yes, yes. This this is this speedrun is to make the uh, the new new base parts in the update. So the roofs, the big room. I mean everything's flooding, but that's fine. Doesn't matter. Still gonna still gonna make the pieces. You can't stop me. Time Here. There you go, we got we got our glass glass domes, big room, and a little little compartment door. <laughs> 